Hey guys, <clears throat> so I know I've been gone off my channel for a while. Um, I'm just kind of starting this intro. It's gonna, this video is gonna be over the next couple of days. But I am coming on, you know, just to start and um, kind of start this new lock journey that I'm getting ready to go on. Um, I've been on and off of YouTube, you know, sharing my journey. I first started my lock journey with um, Sister Locks. Um, I had my Sister Locks for, I think, one or two years. Um, then I was having some, you know, some stress and some things. And um, I have that CCCA alopecia. And for me, the crown of my head starts to break off, you know, during times of like great stress. And so in that, when I was struggling with my hair breaking off in that area, um, I cut my locks off. And then I rocked a little TWA for a while. And then I got locks put back in my hair and that time I want to say I started those with um, two strand twists and I did that twice um, I started with two strand twists at first I tried to I was gonna start with um, kinky twists but then I ended up taking the kinky twist out and just having my hair twisted um, then I got bored with having the locks in you know I did the, the journey for about a year a little more than a year then I would cut my hair because I just like to change my hair. I like to change it up, you know. So that was the second time I went through, you know, the lock journey starting with, um, you know, the sister locks, then the two strand twist, and then maybe about two and a half years ago, I had again started with two strand twists. My hair was starting to lock, I got bored. I started coloring my hair and I had red you know well first I had it bleached and I was trying to do I think like some gray or whatever um, yeah I was trying to do like a gray and then I ended up dyeing it red and I rocked that for a little while and then um, I was stressed you know going through things you know with my husband I got married and just going through some things and so I cut my hair all off because um, I had I kept dyeing it and you know I, I think I did color removal a couple of times because the red wasn't the way I wanted it and so I just really messed up my locks and you know my mentality is hair is gonna grow back and so now I'm at a stage in my life, um, I'm ready for my, to have my hair locked again. Um, my husband's passed away. So I'm in a lot of life transition. And with life transition, I want to change my hair. Um, I would have started the locks a while ago, but probably about, I wanna say maybe back in September, October time, I literally shaved off all my hair. I went in the bathroom, I took a pair of clippers, and I shaved off all my hair bald. Um, just, you know, going through things, going through transitions, going through journeys. And so, my husband, he died a couple of weeks ago in February. Um, and I just made this decision that I'm starting a new journey. Now, the way that I'm starting that new journey is the way that I'm starting that new journey. It is going to be locks. Um, sorry, let me turn this TV down. Um, I'm starting my new journey is going to be locks. And there will be a lot of people in this lock community that's not going to like the way I'm starting my locks. And I just want to make sure I make this perfectly clear right here, right now. I don't really care if anybody likes the way I start my locks, but my videos that I'm going to put as I go through my journey, the way that I'm going through it, I'm going to be posting videos. So if someone should choose 
to have their locks done the way that I'm gonna start them, then maybe my videos will be able to help them. Um, so I'm just gonna let y'all know now. On Saturday, today is Thursday. Um, no, today is Wednesday, March 3rd. And on Saturday, March 14th, I will be driving down to Houston and I will be getting permanent lock extensions installed into my hair. Why am I getting it? Because I've done the journey multiple times and I don't, I don't want to start with, even with my hair short. One, I don't want to start with short hair. Two, I don't want to start with two strand twists, comb coils. I don't want to start with all any of that. I don't want to do it that way. So I'm not gonna. I'm that person, if everybody's saying, oh, you need to start it this way, you need to start it that way, I guarantee you I'm going to do it the opposite way. Um, I don't follow the norm because I'm Tadanya and Tadanya do it the way she want to do it. I'm just that hard-headed and that stubborn. But I want to share my journey with you all. It's a journey because I'm starting at point A and I'm going to slowly make my way to point B. B, C, D, E, F, G, all the way to Z. Um, I will eventually, as my hair is growing out, slowly cut the um, lock extensions off. Um, but I won't be doing that for a while because I'm going to make sure I still have the length that I want. Um, but yeah. I know that was like a little bit of a rant. And I'm just in a space where I'm going to be having a little bit of rants, you know, for a while. There's a lot of things that are, are changing in my life. You know, like I said, my husband passed away. Um, I'm finally getting ready to start back working on my Ph.D. program um, at Walden University. Um, so I start classes back up in June because I took about a two year break from my academic classes because um going through some things with my husband and his health um so yeah you know and um me and my daughter she's getting ready to turn 18 well she's actually 18 but she's getting ready to graduate high school so we're going to be going you know she's getting ready to go off to college so that's going to be a new transition for me because i'm going from having a house full of people with me and then a person whom i've been around for their whole in life 18 years to being by myself so I'm probably gonna have some little lifestyle videos on here as well just kind of sharing that journey and be, you know that whole what is it called um, empty nesters you know so starting that that's gonna be a whole new thing for me figuring out what to do because my life has been around, revolved around other people. And now it's time for me to start putting myself first. So, I'm not used to that, guys. I'm not used to that at all. But, I just wanted to pop on here real quick. I thought it was going to be, like, super quick. That way I could just add this video with the video of after I get my install to this one. But I can't remember how many minutes I'm allowed to have on my YouTube videos. So that being said, depending on how long my videos can be, I might just add to this and it'd be one video or I might be making this two videos. But just stay with me. You know, I know I haven't been on here in a while. I'm going to do better. Um, so if you've been a subscriber with me, thank you for still being a subscriber with me, even though I haven't been on here doing anything. And... If you're going to be new to my channel, you know, thank you. Thank you for hitting the subscribe button and wanting to see, you know, what I'm going to be all about. Sorry, I keep looking down. I'm not used to this whole looking in the camera. I like to look at myself because, you know, I think I'm so fresh, so clean, so beautiful. That's just me. But um, I will see y'all again on, um, I'm fidgety. I'm sorry. I got to get used to this. Um, see y'all on Saturday. Um, I'll probably do a quick little video of me getting ready to drive to Houston because I am in Austin 
and I'm driving down to Houston to um, to see Be Youthful. If you've seen her on YouTube, she does lock extensions and she's down in Houston. So that's about a two hour drive. So I'll be leaving here because I think I got to be there at um, nine o'clock. But I'm not a morning person, so I'm going to have to leave here at like 5 30, 6 o'clock just so I can stop, get my coffee, stuff like that. Um, so I'll do like maybe a quick video or something. Um, then once I have my install, I'll probably make a video, you know, when I get home because me and my daughter were supposed to be going prom dressing, finding for her. So I don't know. But I'll make a video, finish it up, and then get it posted. And I hope y'all stay and hang out with me and follow me on these multiple of journeys that I'm going on be it my lock journey my empty becoming an empty nester um and going back to school to finish my PhD in clinical psychology but until then y'all have a wonderful day and I will talk to y'all soon bye